hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel please feel free to subscribe on my channel and if you're a subscriber we're like we're the film the everything welcome back so what are we gonna be talking about today to be deep please tell us we are going to be talking about friendships chit chats about friendships yeah and a quick and very important disclaimer we are only saying this as our opinion, not because generally friendships should be or friendships are. Yes, please. Oh. From our experiences and from just what we think. Yes. Yeah. So we're gonna be eating the chips. And Coca Cola. We'll be drinking or eating Coca Cola. I mean, and drinking Coca Cola. <laughs> and yes. bread. Because we are healthy hands, we're trying to balance off. We couldn't eat white no, bread. No, no, we're eating junk food. But also, we couldn't eat like white bread when we have it. Just say we are poor. Right. I know that's right. <laughs> 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 Have they shared that? Oh, I to pour it out. And the cousin, I'm going to pour it out. 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 We pour it out on you, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> we pour it out on you, Lord. Yay! You are worth it, worth it, worth it, Lord. Is that what I'm going to do? What's your name? Mm, I think so. I think two two corn is there some rot. I don't know if you know that. Because I think I'm gonna finish it. Oh yeah. Rico Mina! I tell you fast it! Wait me yet! So as you can see I have my cup of cook colour. Coca Cola. I have a clink. Clink clink. <laughs> right. Come on, minion, guys. I'm so hungry. Yo, we've been hungry since the afternoon. Oh my god. Nana, open the chisenga. How am I supposed to sit? Sharp, now let's eat. I'm trying to imagine. I'm trying to imagine that potato chip. So nice. My chips are better than this. Hi, bro. Ah! So. My good tip is sorry. No, no, bro. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Sorry, guys. I'm back. Right, so. But I'll be eating. I'm so hungry. I'm also hungry. But also, I can't talk when I'm when I'm eating with the food in my mouth. So I quickly want to like introduce the topic. Yeah. And then when someone swallows, then we're gonna start talking, right? We're gonna talk about friendships mainly. We've said that before, right? But mainly, it's gonna be a lot about our own experience as friends mm -hmm. because we've been through a lot, I guess. Mm -hmm. And actually, there's something that I wanted to text her yesterday that I'm actually gonna say on this video, so she's gonna hear for the first time. Mm. Guys, I wanna cry, please. Mm -hmm. I wanted to text her yesterday, but I was like, oh, she's gonna come anyway, so let's just do it in person. Let's see if when she sends crying faces, is she crying for free? Okay, not really trying to make her cry, but like that's something that I wanted to say to her. <laughs> I will not have preparing to fake cry. Anywho, <laughs> um, let's start. Where do we start? Um, the importance of friendship. Mm -hmm. What is yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what is your take on that? Like how important do you think friendships are? Well, because I'm not good at I'm not good at explaining things, but mm -hmm. I feel like friendship is very important because in life we all go through challenges, right? Mm -hmm. And you don't want to go through those challenges when you're alone. So you need someone. Mm -hmm. If it's someone uh, on your age, because you're gonna be going through the same thing, so you need someone who's going through what you're going through, so you can go through things together. I hope you get what I'm saying. <laughs> It's more relatable with a friend because yeah. <clears throat> you can have a sibling that's quite close to you, right? In age, but, it, but they everything. won't also they, they won't understand the depth of whatever you're going through. With friendships, it's like you spend most of your time together, mm -hmm. 
in the same space even if i'm not like in the exact same space mm. for example we didn't go to the same university so by the way we went to the same primary so yeah. primary uh -huh. same, 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 high school. same high school and then university separation and we, we didn't think it was gonna happen like that yeah also we said to let me meeting. but it's fine ma'am mm -hmm. she I wanted the whole thing live but no, she's fine. lying i wanted to say because um you made me forget what i wanted to say ma'am yeah no i forgot i, I forgot completely Mm -hmm. But yeah, oh no, I was still saying in the same space, though we're not in the same university, mm -hmm. I still know uni experience with your sibling. Mm -hmm. They're trying to guide you, but still like caring for you or restricting, trying to save you from the mistakes they made. With and besides me, that, like our siblings don't really like talk about everything when they talk to us because mm -hmm. they be like, don't do this. But I want to understand why I shouldn't be doing this. You get what I'm saying? Sure. So this one, I'm talking to my parents, Steve. Like I tell her everything, she knows everything that is happening on my life. I know mm -hmm. I am getting that pillow feeling you're okay. Whatever she's going through, I'm going through that. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I feel like yeah, it's very important. Friendship. And also friendship. another thing, guys, with siblings, right? Mm -hmm. They're not as transparent. Okay, they can be really honest with you about situations, mm -hmm. but they're not as transparent with what they went through. Mm -hmm. And another thing I learned is just because you haven't went through something it doesn't mean you have to go through it to learn something from it mm. if my best friend goes through like um what, what can i say how can i say it a heartbreak that's a mother mm -hmm. i don't have to go through that to know or to know how to be treated if i was treated like the bottom if when i tell it to my friend she should know that Ain't no nigga supposed to treat me like that, you know. And I'm gonna kill a nigga who that who that's my birthday, guys. I'm gonna kill a nigga. Wait, guys, I am gonna kill a nigga. Wait, okay. The, <laughs> the main thing we're saying is, yeah, friendships are important because you find someone on your age, very much relatable, and it's like family that you choose for yourself. Tendo. <laughs> it's like family that you choose for yourself. Right now, my mom has a relationship with her mom because of us. If it wasn't for us, they wouldn't know each other women. So yeah, they have a relationship because of us. You know? Yeah. So yeah. I feel like it's a family that you choose for yourself. Okay, first Lene, I feel like like okay, let's just, you know, tell people how we met. I think it's gonna be cool for people to know how we met and everything. Understand that those people are not related to you. Gamaro. Mm -hmm. You must edit and put that. Translation. They're not related to you by blood. But you guys cho chose, you made a choice to be each yeah. other's sisters or brothers. Do you understand? Yeah. So I just feel like the fact that you made that decision, that you're going to let this person into your life. And maintain, like to maintain. trust that person to tell them about everything about yourself and even like your background and everything. Yo, guess what? It's scary, guys. Mm, it, it's actually very <laughs> scary. <laughs> it is. Yo. But I feel like, in my own opinion, okay, not in my own opinion, in my experience, I haven't had like the worst experience with friendships. The yeah. people who go through the most with friendships, I haven't. Yeah. I'm blessed like that, and that's one period. I also don't think I went through. Do you the think? Mm -mm. Yeah, I haven't. Cause no, we haven't. Yeah, when I went to university, I met friends and they were like nice to me. Everything <laughs> was okay. But do you think they were nice to you? Like, I'm just saying, we're like, we never had, like, you know, you know how friends are like, they're always mm -hmm. having. Shh, okay. Yeah, and also, then I was. We never had a scene <clears throat> where, like, maybe we were fighting or something, we arguing or something, like. Yeah, I also yeah, feel like I when think. when I came to university, I got genuine people. Yeah. I had my close friend address, and I had my close friend, my close friend who was always there for me, like at school. And that's why, like, some people be like, "How many best friends do you have?" It's her, and then it's the like the other one person that was always with me here when I was in university, <laughs> guys. Don't you best friend? When I was here in university. So I feel like I honestly can't disregard her what? Her presence or 
the role that you played in my life at that time. And I wish she was here, you know. Yes. It was gonna be nicer. Gonna be so nice. Oh my yeah. god. It was gonna be nicer about how we handle like this kind this of whole friendship. You know. Actually. So now we talked about how important friendships are. Yeah. Now we can move on to like difficulties, like, challenges. challenges. Yeah. Yeah. The how and how we overcome them. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think the challenge that we had was the long distance because mm -hmm. you know she has friends I have my friends I'm spending more time with my friends every day she's spending more time with her friends every day mm -hmm. so we had that thing you order like we're no longer talking like every day yeah. it's just this, this thing you order like maybe we talk after two weeks she calls me okay this happened when when yeah you know if I'm going but I don't think we lasted like two weeks without texting in between maybe calling here yeah, yeah but I calling don't think yeah. we lasted two weeks because two weeks would mean Half of a man. That's not true. <laughs> yeah. So like, it was just that thing. You're okay. If we're having a phone call, if I have, if I'm going through something, you know, I call her. I tell her, okay, I'm going through this. You know, we help each other out, like giving each other advice and everything. So it was just. But also, I don't think there was much detail like now. Maybe it's because now we're closer to each other, even in distance. Yeah. Because yeah. now I'm like I'm able to tell you details of like. Yeah. Oh, I think like this is how this went down. This is how this yeah. went down. But then I'd be like, you know, last week I actually had a fight with Mang Mang Bi just because this. of something silly. And, and now it's like, this now it's like yeah. you get into detail of what yeah. really happened. I was walking through the door, <laughs> and then after the door closed, <laughs> hey, this person did what I did. Yeah, and yeah. the reason why you fighting, like, I, th I think now we just talk about it. So, but, so that was like our challenge that we had. And also, I feel like at that time we slacked much with communicating about our friendship. We were supporting each other spiritually a lot. Yeah, spiritually. A damn lot. Number one. Number one. Mm -hmm. If we're going through tough times, she'd wake up, call me, let's pray together. Mm. And ish, when I think I don't want this to be emotional. Let me not say this part. Tiffany, I know what you want to talk about. Mm. What the hell me? That time. My dad. Mm. Ah, don't cry. Don't make me cry. Don't ah. make me cry. Ah. Ah. Right! I'm a thug! Mm. Drink this, drink this. Oh my god. Yeah, when I lost my dad. No, let's not talk about that. But yeah, that time we were very strong spiritually. We were strong. Yo, it's like we knew something was coming. Yo, when I tell you, Okay, let's just leave it out. Yeah. It's a story for another for day. For another day. But when we are ready to talk about it, we'll talk we'll about it. Through, but yeah. now. But that Please time, comment down below if you want a story time about it. If like maybe you just lost someone you really love in your life. Like, I don't think you're ready. Yeah, I'm not ready, but I'm I'm saying when I'm ready, when the time is right, I will be able to share with you guys how I, how I overcame because both of us it was the time we were writing examinations. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I, I don't mind sharing with you guys how I, but I'll try guys. I don't know when, but I'll try. Just comment down below if you want me to make another video about that. Mm. Yeah. And I feel like for you, it was like a harder time. Your exams were really close. Mine, I think I had like three days apart. Like, whatever. Challenges. So like, at that time, we're supportive, very supportive in spiritually. And I feel like I didn't have any other friend that I used to talk to about spiritual stuff beside yeah. her. So I didn't have anywhere to go. You know like same as me. Mm -hmm. So we were like mm. hey, what you ask? Hey, what you ask? <laughs> you know? But yo, like, yeah. and I remember yo I remember I also had a challenge like yo okay I'm gonna roll watch him. Yeah we were fighting. <laughs> you think so? No, I mean we're like we're fighting like with you know trying to balance life and spiritual like and Oh yeah, yeah. That, you know, that yeah, it was really tough. Yeah, that time it was tough. Yeah, yeah. You know, but but we're here now. <laughs> <laughs> so story for another day. So story, that was oh, another day. Another day. A lot to talk about. <laughs> but I feel like that time we didn't know how to communicate about our friendship. Maybe yeah. because we're younger, yeah. but we didn't know how to communicate about our friendship. Like yeah. now, it's like we understand. The people that we are, I don't know if it makes sense. Yeah, we understand. Like, I'm a person that like opens up quite quickly. Mm. Let's make a scenario, right? Mm. If I go through, for instance, a breakup, 
I am most likely to tell her the day happened. Mm. She's most likely to take a week to think and then tell me after a week. And I feel like that balance, <laughs> <laughs> that balance is now there. Like, cause we're grown up, we get to understand that okay, yeah. there's not a person that opens up fast, but I am a person that she's, opens up fast. Like, and I do. Like, I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to. No, change. That, and that's the thing. You don't have to change Name. that because I'm this way. Yeah. So, so that is a challenge. <clears throat> so I got to understand. And you, on the other hand, you're that kind of friend. Then I'm going to the most of the world. And then now I'm starting to have a bad day because she's telling me that. Come get me. At this point, I'm like, I wish you didn't tell me. I remember that day you told me I'm gonna have bad news. Mm. Like when I was at work, oh, I just yeah. had a bad day. And, and, that day. and that's the thing, man. I feel like that was very selfish of me because I know that she's busy. Like she has to focus. But then, anyway, I couldn't wait until after. <laughs> but anyways, it's cool. It's fine as long as you know, like when you're talking to me, I don't mind. As long as you know that when you're talking to me, you feel better because someone knows it's okay. Because I don't want to be like, you know, depression is oh. real, Ngani. Depression is it. I don't want, want to be that person in which, like, I'm like, I wake up to me and I'm like, they tell me, oh, you lost your friend. You get what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Because, yo, now I'll have to re- to live with that regret, regression feeling. Yeah, regression. I think it exists. <laughs> yeah, I would be like, maybe she tried calling me and I didn't take a call yeah. because, you know. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. But, like, yeah. Okay, I don't let's... mind. I don't mind. I'm gonna. You can disturb me. It's fine. Let's let's talk about how we overcame the whole thing. You know the whole the challenge. Okay, the, okay. Remember the challenge. It's about long distance. Okay, it was long distance. Great communication, like clear communication. Space. Yeah. Clear communication. I think that was like the top two. I don't yeah, think we had any other. Uh, okay, let, wait. Before we co- continue, like, please let's just like mention more challenges that people face out there. Like, the okay, ones friendships. Because I'm sure people want to. I don't know if I can be able to talk about betrayal. Has it ever happened to me? Yeah, just don't make examples. Just talk about how, you know, some people can betray you and everything. Just don't mention names. Guys, now I don't know. I feel like if it ever happens to me, I wouldn't be able to handle it. It would feel more like a breakup if ever I. Because I just feel like friendships are. I am more. I pay, uh, wait, I feel like friendships are more painful than. Wait, am I lying? Oh, more yes. Than, sh- C- let me tell you. I've had a same, friend of mine. There's, wait, there's a. Like this, it, it has the same feeling as when you're balancing a relationship with your boyfriend. Ish, I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. Cause imagine if she tells me that she doesn't want to be my friend anymore. I'm gonna have that pain. The I've same been told pain. that. Yeah, I'm gonna have the same pain as when the like a boyfriend is telling her that and, they don't yeah, want to date me. I've been told that before by my friend here in uni. She actually doesn't mind me telling the story, but I accept that <laughs> I would make a video with her. <laughs> and she ended our friendship, guys. I can't believe it. I was crying. Real tears. If she doesn't watch this video, I'm going to kill her. <laughs> I cried tears. And it was like a three-way friendship, right? And then she said she doesn't want to be friends with the two of us. Mm. I go to my other friend crying and she's laughing at me. She's like, why are you crying, B? <laughs> I'm like, I can't have it. I can't believe my... Like, it was so... Pretty. Your friendships, guys. <laughs> please. Please. Yeah, so... What else were we saying? Oh no! Oh, another. Th- okay, okay. Another thing was our time management. Yeah, time management. Your, your time management. Get, like in this, in the four years of being in school, I would see you in person because we used to video call every time. But yeah. I would see you in person very few times. Yeah, and maybe if it's during the holidays, like you see me once or twice. Yeah, I mean that. Yeah. Because maybe like December, she goes on holiday when I'm at home. When she Wait, comes don't say holiday, I... honey. Labels. From holiday, I go to vacations. <laughs> I mean that with no. family. She would go like on family vacations. And when she comes back, I'm I going. feel like I'm bragging. Wait. <laughs> and when she comes back, I'm going. Like our family. She, yeah. yeah. When yeah. I come back, she's going on a family yeah. vacation. It was hectic. <laughs> Every time. But we are here now. Uh, uh. Yeah, so that is also another. Okay, so another challenge that I've seen from different people is that, like, you know, there are some people I don't understand. They want one person to, like, if me, I'm saying you, you're my best friend, right? Mm-hmm. 
they don't want you to have another friend you got what i'm saying so that is also one of the challenge one of the challenges i do people... not want like the jealousy part in it, it's a very sensitive thing because I've, I've seen people on the internet talking about it but also i feel like it's just normal Next. for me don't you think you felt some kind of mm. yeah you felt like i kept on like posting this person that i was always with mm. You understand? Yeah, my like, yeah, right. It's okay. It's no, not like wait, jealous. it's straight. Wait, so I'm saying what like it's okay to be jealous. No, obviously I felt jealous a lot of times. Even mm -hmm. when you post part, like I get jealous. I'm like <gasps> You used to tell me, at least you talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> you can't keep it in your heart, you mean mm. you're gonna kill somebody. <laughs> the big challenge is like having great communication guys. And as she's saying it, good communication in friendships is just as important as in romantic relationships. Mm. Okay. It is just as important as in like your romantic relationship because you can't handle it without community. And one thing, one other challenge. I don't understand, guys. You do everything for your boyfriend, you give him money, boyfriend allowance, you do what what. But you can't do that thing for your friends. Johnny, how? Why? You buy things, your boyfriend, whatever. And you cut out your friends, maybe because of your own reasons. Now you're giving your boyfriend more attention. And then when he leaves you, now you're left with no friend. Because you cut your friend cut you cut all your friends out because you wanted to give your boyfriend more time. What I'm saying, what I'm trying to say now is like that same energy that you give your boyfriend should be the same kind of energy sure. that you give your friends. Sure. You get what I'm saying? That's true. I but like, also I feel like friends me, should also understand the fact that you have a boyfriend. The the I don't want to say the energy. The time won't be the same. Yeah. Now you have to split the time between. Yeah. Those two. Obviously, you will understand, but just don't like cut them off like for yeah like. Yeah, no. You yeah, can't yeah, spend no. more than two weeks without talking your without talking to your friends. You get what I'm saying? And also the thing of like only talking to your friends because you and your you, boyfriend are going through the most. And, and also when you need help, like exactly. You're like, no, nah, I need money. Oh, I'm gonna give you my mom. She's gonna like, send you nah. money. Mm, nah. <laughs> Nah, yo, you know what he's doing. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna, you know, today he. Hey, I'm gonna, you know, yesterday he. My day is not gonna, how you doing? I'm gonna, are you You okay? don't even ask. Mm. And when you're busy asking for something and you don't even ask, you only want support through, yes. and financial assistance or just like your French presence yeah. when you know that on the other hand things are going wrong. That is wrong. Mm -hmm. Be there for your friends, guys. Be there These are tough friends. times. Like, people are getting more away. Uh, what did I say? <laughs> People are being more aware with like mental health yeah. and check on your friends. Your friends that are going through tough times and are, are not sure whether that is or not, mm. help them. You know, like the different ways. Just be there for different them. ways which don't cause the thing to find out whether or not you're going through depression or whatever. Mm. Why are we even talking about deep stuff? No, like it got me thinking too much because hey, like mental health is very much important. But then it's let's move. That's a topic for another day, guys. Yeah, and oh, but also the bottom line is friendships are as important as romantic mm. relationships. Mm -hmm. Don't take your friends for a ride just because you like my friend. A simple example of which I know, I think everyone understands and gets mm. is you were with your friend before you met your boyfriend. When he leaves or when he fucks up, you're still gonna go back to your friends. Okay. So don't use your friends. Treat them as people, please. Yeah. Those people are not here. Your friends are your listen. brothers and sisters, guys. Mm -hmm. Those are the people that you should like trust the most. Even though they're people that you can trust, but you know, you know when I'm in your and heart. I, I feel like man, I feel like we're only talking from a side of privilege because mm -hmm. we. I don't think we've went through the most of friendship. Yeah. People have went through the most of friendship. <laughs> hey, hey, my friend, my man. Hey, hey my friend, my man. How is that been men in one sentence? People, guys, people are going through the most. People have like, went through the most friendship. Guys, you must have a girl code. Like, respect your friend's partner. Yes, you can know them, you can be their friends, but you must place that boundary, you know? Yeah, I, this chat is just another chat. 
no but i'm gonna just, talk about yeah it. i'm just giving an advice to some people out there like that are actually misusing the part of your friendship because mm. they feel like oh this is my best friend so her boyfriend should be my best friend you get what i'm saying yeah now yeah, you start yeah, being on a her boyfriend you start being like you know yeah, touchy touchy and everything mm. no Ooh, boundaries honey Mm. But what are we talking about? Like, oh, general friendships in general. Yeah, I don't was... think we went for a ride. Also, if you guys have like other questions about our friendship, we've been friends since grade six. Let's come here. How I'm gonna? No, I'm not counting. While you're counting, let me say this. Um, what did I want to say? <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> We're getting old, guys. I forgot what I wanted this to say. This year is gonna be the fifth year. I'm gonna say Johnny. Fifty-eight. I mean the <laughs> the eleven. Okay, something like that. Yeah, the eleven. What am I saying? Yo, guys. The eleventh year. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, cause grade twenty twelve for Robertica. Okay. Grade eight. So grade six twenty ten. Grade seven twenty eleven then. Mm, okay. I wanted to say something but I forgot. This thing was really important but she distracted me guys. Yo, this girls. Distraction I girls. I think it's very much important. Ah! What did I wanna say? Let me think. Should I remind you I was counting years? No, but then it's fine, it's part. Maybe I'll think of it. So would you, would you, we just finished talking about the challenges, right? Because um, we didn't like face a lot of challenges. I mean, we didn't have like mm. challenges. And also, we I think we also threw in advice. Cause yeah, we just yeah. Giving I don't think advices. we went through the most. But I was saying that if you guys have went through different things, and I swear I will also come onto her channel and respond to comments. Oh yeah, I wanted to say a comment if you have been through the most with your friend. Mm -hmm. Just comment what happened, you know. <laughs> or if you'd want like some advice from us. Yeah, you can just if you're like it. dealing with any friendship drama now, yeah. <clears throat> also, guys, don't be friends with people that are selfish. Mm -hmm. If you find that, if you guys communicate for sure, and your friends like are being selfish and they're like, if you don't say anything to them, they won't say anything to you. Mm -hmm. And you guys have been communicating, it just let them know. Even if you guys don't communicate, just let them know that you know what. Yeah, especially those kind of friends where you I don't like, appreciate the fact that if I don't reach out to you, you won't reach out to me. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Mm. Like, at all. I, I mean, we can't, we understand that we're growing, we can't talk every day and stuff. But if I don't reach out at all, you will never. Mm. Please. That's giving and not getting, and that's toxicity on 100. Mm. I know that's right. Yeah. yeah, we've said quite a lot. So we're done with the challenges, right? So now we can just talk about how do you maintain friendship? How do you maintain our friendship? friendship? Yeah. Okay, we can talk about our friendship then, because yes, we call each other ten times a day. Um, uh, the call starts from eight o'clock, and then you call again like ten o'clock, okay, and yeah. then twelve o'clock. But on a on a normal day, on a normal day, uh, we talk in the morning before we do our. We, no, just tell them what it started like last week. When she's doing her business of the day, I'm gonna text them and be like, Morning, don't lie, since you moved since you moved, I will Yeah, since liar. I was guys, this girl is using me. Ever since I came to her thing, she had been texting me every time. Call him twenty four seven and I'm mute. I'm not used to that. But <laughs> now I feel like me calling you every minute is just because of the circumstance. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right. I I need that. Because yeah. I call her in the middle of her day, daily business. She doesn't want to be washing clothes. I want to talk to you. <laughs> when she's washing this, I want to talk. When she's cooking, I want to talk. You know? But Yo, guys, generally, I this is what we call investing to friendships. I am sure we're going to come back after 30 years and be like, <laughs> Happy 30th anniversary to a friendship. <laughs> <laughs> but I generally, I talk to you in the morning, have yeah. a great day at work. And you never wish me to have a great day chilling. I do. Liar. Let's go through our chat. Also, guys, I saved her with a heart and she didn't even save my not even with a dog. Guys, not this emoji. is one of the challenges that not we face. Dry friendship. <laughs> she doesn't spice things up. One thing about her. But generally how we maintain it is communication. Like, okay, not that we're supposed to talk every day, but yeah. we, we are able to. 
So for those who can't, it's okay. As long as you guys have that level of communication. Mm -hmm. Sometimes people come from work, they're tired, come from school, they're tired. But I mean, we usually like always, you know, on our phones now. Yeah, and I feel like if you go through the most and you have that one friend, don't forget, you must remind yourself, no, I have TV, it's it, that is that I can talk to, man. Don't go through something yourself alone because you end up taking decisions that will affect other people around around yes. you, you get what I'm saying? Yes. So, yeah, it's important to mm. like talk about what you go And through. also like, it's important to understand the type of friends that you have. Yeah. Like, understand. guys, I can't stress this enough. It's very important. Yeah. Some people have bad days. Some people, you know, like, you know that if my friend is talking like this, she's just having a bad day. Mm. She wants her space. Because normally, as a normal person, there are days where you want your space. Mm. You just don't feel like talking. Just woke up in a bad mood mm. and that's completely okay. Mm. But the thing is, communicate to a point where you understand your friends. Yeah, you must understand. Because otherwise, if you don't understand, you want to have friends because I feel like we all go through those kind of, sorry, mm. those kind of days where like, <coughs> yeah, just want to be alone. let me tell you something. <coughs> But don't come for me. Let me tell you something. If you feel like everyone has a problem with you, you are probably the problem. Because Thank you. How is everyone always just running away from you? That is not true. Thank you. You are not a real one. Okay, I'm not, I'm not that violent. But please. Guys, please. this will lead us into making another video talking about mm -hmm. relationship. Yeah, boy and girl, partner, lovey dovey, romantically. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Let's talk about that kind of like topics but not now and that's that too next time good. next time yeah ask for it guys comment 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 yeah, honestly, comments. Comments. <clears throat> comment. and honestly ne, guys i'm not even playing you guys i'm not happy with how inconsistent you've been if you drop the like why wouldn't you go comment it just okay go comment say something loved watching this video enjoyed watching this video i'm still washing dishes i'm gonna come back and watch it do something cool. say something guys. please even just dropping that emoji thing and location thing you know yeah i, know, I love that one <laughs> yeah i love that one. i don't know why you know i want my first one here yeah i love you you know please. for notification bell notification gang mm -hmm. gang gang you know like honestly guys please if you honestly subscribing, you lose nothing. You lose nothing. How much? Zero rent. <laughs> so guys, like if you want to add up something from what we're talking about, be free to comment. Yeah. And if you just want to see something. more videos, like not yeah. just sit down, anything. If you want us to do challenges, me and her. And, and you know, one day when we have when we have money, we're gonna have those vacation vlogs. Just yeah. now, we're still broke. You get what I'm saying? Guys, also, it reminds me of lockdown. Lockdown by sister. Maybe we were just gonna go to a restaurant like vlogging and yeah. then like and also now just buy milkshake. Now, <laughs> now we are closer to each other. Guys, we're growing, we have problems. We could have like yeah. a weekend away, maybe on a cottage in a to a cottage in a farm, just chill, not having internet maybe. Yeah. We can take videos, sure, but we won't be having internet to connect maybe with the world. Mm. Just like to take a breather and have like real conversations and cry. Mm -hmm. You know? So <laughs> let's end this video. <laughs> Should we end the video? I think. Yeah, we've said oh, enough. More than enough. Guys, this video is long. I, if you came this far, if you watched this video until this last part of the video, guys, you You're are the most amazing one. person. Like you are the real one. You the realest in the game. You are the best. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you learned something from this video. And maybe if you are the problem in the relationship that you have with your friends, please fix that. Don't please guys, friends friendships are important. Very important. So guys, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.